popular spice with great medicinal value. It is one of the five major spices cultivated in India. Food conscious Indians show more interest in the cultivation of turmeric. India produces 90% of the total turmeric produced in the world. Tamil Nadu and Andhra Pradesh states lead in turmeric cultivation. New technologies are being introduced not only in cultivation of turmeric but also in post-harvest processing of turmeric. The new technology developed by E-Road farmers helps to process turmeric in much shorter time. This technology is now getting popular among farmers with the advice and support from Tamil Nadu Agriculture University. Shortage of labor is the major problem faced in agriculture today. Tamil Nadu Agricultural University introduces various types of agricultural implements to help the farmers to manage this problem. Sometimes farmers themselves develop some technology or implement to cope up with shortage of labor. Erode turmeric farmers who met with the challenge of turmeric processing devised themselves this new technology of processing by steam method. Turmeric is a tropical crop. Red soil is much suitable for turmeric cultivation. Turmeric is mostly cultivated as an irrigated crop. In Tamil Nadu, the right season to plant turmeric is May and June. We have to prepare the land with three to four tractor tilling. After the last tillage, we have to apply organic manure at the rate of five tons per acre. After leveling the field, we have to form raised buns at an interval of 45 centimeters. 1000 kilogram of seed turmeric is needed for cultivating one acre. The seed turmeric has to be planted at a depth of 4 cm at the end of the bars at an interval of 15 to 20 cm. I followed precision farming method. I used chisel plow for deep tillage. Then I applied 10 tons of organic manure. After this, I tilled the land again and again four times. Then I formed drip irrigation system with an interval of three feet and I planted seed turmeric at the end of the bars. Fixing drip irrigation system and applying water-soluble fertilizers through the drip system helps to get good results. We learnt about precision farming method from the scientists of Tamil Nadu Agricultural University. We have cultivated 10 acres in this method and after of this, 4 acres of land is cultivated with turmeric. This method saves half of the labor needed and half of the water needed. Earlier, we used to get only 30 quintals of turmeric. Now, in the new method, we get an yield of 40 to 50 quintals. The turmeric harvested from the soil will have mud and dust initially. It gets value addition only after cleaning, grading, steaming and polishing. In earlier days, it would take several days for processing of harvested turmeric and hence sending it to the market got delayed. In those days, it was very difficult to process turmeric in the days of bad weather. Shortage of labor caused more worries to the farmers. Farmers used to say that turmeric processing is more difficult 
than turmeric cultivation. In earlier days, farmers used to make direct fire to boil turmeric. In the next stage, farmers set deep stoves three feet below the land. After that, the stove which was in cubic shape was made into a conical shape to enhance the heat. Then they used to fix two barrels instead of a single barrel. Thus, the new technology got evolved step by step. Before 1994, we processed turmeric by direct heating method. It took much of labor. The new steam method helps us to process two acres of turmeric in just three days instead of earlier eight days processing method. We used a small barrel in earlier days. It took many laborers for processing and hence the cost was higher. Hand operated barrel method was difficult one. It took up to 25 days for turmeric processing. Every problem has a solution in itself. Farmers of Erode region found out an indigenous solution for the problem of processing turmeric. In the initial days, farmers used to make fire for heating one barrel of turmeric. Then, this one barrel was changed to two barrels. After that, instead of heating the barrel with direct fire, they made use of steam to heat the barrel. Then, Instead of two barrels, they involved a series of barrels. As I told, the turmeric processing method has been continuously evolved by the farmers. Instead of single barrel in the old method, they now use four barrels or even six barrels at a time. Today, the technology has been perfected so that up to 200 barrels of turmeric is processed in a single day. Now, 150 to 200 barrels of turmeric are processed using this technology. Earlier, I followed single barrel method with direct heating. Then I visited a farm in Anandapuram. They were following two barrels method. I applied the same method in my farm. In the following years, I used three barrels method and then four barrels method in a successful way. Now we have developed a processing method in which steaming is done in a tractor trailer even while it is traveling. The task which took four days to complete is now finished within 36 hours. Moreover, this new technology has ensured good quality. In the small barrel heating method followed in the earlier days, a lot of laborers were involved. Nowadays, tractor trailers are taken directly to the field and after loading and after loading turmeric, steam is filled from a boiler. Thus, the boiling process is finished in a very short time. This steam method is very effective. It is very quick. It involves only a few laborers. Since processing is done in the field itself, it is cost effective. Just 5 members can process 15 tons of turmeric within 12 hours. The uprooted turmeric plants themselves can be used as a fuel. Coconut coir, other plant based from the farm, can also be used as a fuel. The whole process is very simple. At the same time, 
we get high quality turmeric. Though the cost involved is almost the same, the new method saves much time. The process which took 4 days to complete is now finished within 36 hours. The steaming operation which took 20 minutes is now finished within 5 minutes. Since the processing is done in bulk quantity, the quality is good with uniform turmeric tubers. The cost involved for making a processing unit is rupees 1 lakh and 30,000. Now, Spices Board of India extends subsidy support to the farmers. The cost of production of this unit was rupees 1 lakh 30,000 last year. This year, the cost has raised to 1 lakh 75,000. Even then, nearly 100 steaming units are being involved in turmeric processing in this area. The farmers are in urgency to process turmeric within two months, that is, before summer. Farmers are given up to 50% subsidy support. We, the farmers of this area, have developed this technology as per our knowledge level. An institution recognized by Government of India have accepted this technology and given subsidy support for cage wheel, trailer and plough. Tamil Nadu government gives subsidy support at the rate of rupees 10,000 for cage wheel and rupees 10,000 for the plough. It is also assured to give rupees 40,000 subsidy support for trailers. They assured us that if we approach them as a farmers group, they will give subsidy support up to 50%. Hence, six of us combined as a group and we have installed a steaming unit. The steaming unit cost is rupees 1 lakh 75,000. We have already availed 50% subsidy from the government. Hence, it is a comfortable project. Now, the steaming unit is used not only by the six members of the group, but also by many farmers of this area. By seeing our success, many farmers approach us. I helped four groups of farmers to install steaming units in this area. Similarly, in Sivagiri area, some six to seven farmers groups have installed such steaming units. All these units are doing well. Erodes farmers who have tasted success request every turmeric farmer in the country to follow drip irrigation system to get good harvest and to follow this new processing technology to get good profit. Yeah.